analysis of this UFO going across the screen. This is before the start of the nationwide 300 race at Daytona on February 25th. This is the opening ceremonies and they're about to do a uh, military flyover with the two jets coming uh, towards the camera and then you're going to see uh, an object fly from the left side of the screen to the right side of the screen and um, we're going to let it play in real time once and then we'll go through and uh, slow it down and look at the shape of the object flying across uh, right behind the flight path of a couple of fighter jets which as far as I know they don't allow anybody to fly near them without shooting them down so uh, we're going to take a look at this here we go pardon the singing Okay, from the left, there it goes, across the screen. Now as the camera pans out to the far right above a telephone pole, the object will stop for just a second here. There it is. Now we're going to go back and look at this slowly. You're going to see in this corner up here, that object that flew across the sky is right there, stationary. It just stopped. So after flying across the sky in just a couple of seconds, Urch puts on the brakes and it's just hovering there. Now it just backs back out, or it's zooming in actually. You're going to see that thing coming across here and we'll just look at that object okay here we go if I can get the uh, Rewind going the way I want it to. Get a good close look at this as it comes across the screen there. A couple of the frames are very clear as to the shape of that. Okay. We're going to get a little bit closer in on it and look at this as it comes across the screen here. And you can clearly see that that's a flat looking or disc shaped object flying not too far behind these two jets. That's a pretty good shot. I mean this thing more or less flies right between the flight path of these things. Look at that. There's a couple of frames here where you can really see, like here, I can really see a V-shape on the bottom of this. Real classic sort of flying saucer sort of shape. There you can again as this thing moves through. Goes out of the frame. And the cameraman goes, Whoa, I gotta back out here and take a look at this. Why do they all of a sudden zoom so far out away from these jets that are supposed to be the focus of this thing? Okay. And now, over here in the corner, is this little disc just sitting there. And it's not moving. See? I'm going frame by frame by frame, and that thing's just sitting there as these jets are flying in on it. 
Now, if I look over again at the sides of this whole picture, look, here's the, here's the jets, okay? This is supposed to be what they're focusing on is the jets. Why did the cameraman zoom out? Because he wanted to see what's going on with this thing over there. He wanted to get that in the frame, that's why. Otherwise, he'd be all zoomed in on them jets. I've watched a lot of these flyovers. They never zoom out and just, you know, get a shot like that because you can't even see the jets in it. Anyway, so there's that object. Came, put on the brakes, spilled the coffee. There they are.